What's going on everyone? It's your boy Jasonator. What you all just watched was part one of the shelf video. It was showcasing all of what I'm showing right now in full detail. So I suggest go wa watching that if you haven't. And right now we're about to get started on shelf number two. Just showing this for people who want to see. Alrighty then. Show off my Nerf gun. Alright. So, we're going to be starting at the very top for this one. As you can see up here, I have, just like what I have on the other side, I have my drones right here, just chilling. Then I got my pop figures right here all lined up with my pelican up here and i have some banished up here with it looking like chief is fighting the uh the hunter so yeah really cool the shadow looks awesome wow whoa that is dope wow i really wish i had a picture of this huh all right <clears throat> But now for the second shelf, you probably just seen a little, but um, <clears throat> yeah, I have, this is what I'm using as my bookshelf up here. So I have all of my Borto and my Naruto manga up here, along with my Captain Underpants books. These are, these are from when I was a kid. And I still, I just still have them because my dad decided to keep them. Yeah, I remember when, uh, when I first got this though. I got this for Christmas, me and my brother. That was really cool. So yeah, I just have my manga up here just chilling, my regular books. And I also have all the Star Wars movies on Blu-ray right here. This is the original 2008 one that came out, which is really cool. Got the micro scale warthog right here i got two japanese cars which is pretty cool i think those these were like called manga something no i actually have the uh i have a little hot wheels collection going on too <clears throat> yeah yeah this one's called mad manga yeah this one's dope All right. Yeah, so we got Mad Manga, and then we got whatever the whatever the hell that was. Yeah. And then we have right here we have my little Master Chief shrine. So you just straight up tell it's a lot of Master Chiefs, from the Versus pack to to Series Thirteen to. I really don't know which one that is. I think that's the Warthog one. Yeah, that's the Warthog one. The Rally Warthog, whatever it is. Defense Point Showdown. We got the uh, Attack Gauss Hog. Uh, that's from the Helmet. Series 12. And this is... So, in the first video, I said that right here was my first ever figure. And... The reason why I say that is because this right here was my first ever figure. But, uh oh. Don't fall. Don't fall. Do not fall, Uno. It's one thing I always got to be careful with when I'm doing this. Alright, let me just pull this out over here. Yeah, okay, so the reason why I said uh, this was my first ever figure was because of these arms and this head so with this figure when i first got it when i first had it with the original torso and everything the the arm the arm ended up uh the ball joint for the arm ended up snapping off so ended up gluing it back together but i i don't really know what happened honestly i remember i had him on an eva on an eva torso for a while and then, yeah, I think I just 
threw like threw the torso away finally but yeah this is my first ever figure right here this is my first this is what it looked like but this is my first ever figure if that makes sense so yeah all right getting sidetracked here though haven't even gone through the first shelf we'll leave that there for now <sighs> but yeah we got everything up here just chilling uh all the master chiefs and we got the master chief collection sdcc exclusive which is awesome we got the batmobile warthog for the little skyline so yeah now to the second or third shelf we have all of my <clears throat> All of the blind bag figures. So we have we have Maverick series right here. Not complete though. Missing three figs. Complete series, complete warrior series right there. We got complete series two, Halo Infinite series two. Completed Halo Infinite series one. We got a completed Clash on the Ring back here. And we're missing one from the 10th anniversary blind bags. Just the active camo cat. Oh God, what is going on with my voice? <clears throat> we have um, we have my Kakashi statue right here, which has blue hair for some reason. I've, I've been needing to go over it with white out. My Akatsuki ring. My kunai, Minato's kunai, for anyone who watches Naruto. We got the uh, Warthog Rally right here with the Cyclops. I know those are supposed to go in the flamethrowers. I just have them right there because it would just take up too much room. And then you got my remote holder right here and my little name tag that I got from Vegas. Really cool, really cool. So yeah, it's the third shelf. Now we get to the fourth one, and you have my uh, my UNSC aircrafts right here. So same as that, just have them in the same row. So we got the Recon Wombat unit or Wombat drone, the Hornet. I believe that's the first one that came out. So really cool, really cool. I'm you guys seen that in my haul video i'm definitely glad i got that we got these guys from the rec packs some turrets around my wasp uh we got some lines right here we got some odsts just chilling and we got the old note so i'm looking at it this way you have the first ever hornet and then you have the newest hornet which is awesome so yeah, it's really cool. Then you have the first ever set that was produced by uh, Halo Mega Blocks. So that's awesome too. Got these active camo figures right here. Active camo, Trailblazer, Recon, and Master Chief. And I already showed these guys off. So yeah. And then in here we have our, we have our Spartan Athlon, just chilling. <laughs> shelf number five and this is where it gets really really cool eh, not really but yeah so these are all of my all of my marines and spartans that i don't have displayed or that i don't have in the dioramas so yeah let's just give you a little pan over of everything Oh yeah, real quick too. You can see that I have the first ever Scorpion and the the like Spec Ops ODST Scorpion. Both used a lot of spare parts, as you can see. Both have a lot of different desert color and a, and a lot of uh, olive green on them with the exosuits in the back. So let me just give you that pan over of the figures right now. Hmm. 
Now, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna put music through that, so you can obviously hear uh, the TV. Right now I'm watching uh, Toe of Ultimate, Ultimate Dooms, uh, build of the McLaren, of the Lego McLaren, which is really cool. So yeah. Yeah, there's nothing to really go over on this shelf other than the figures. So you can see I have my Marine, uh, Infinite Marines right here, and then you slowly transition into the olive green uh, Spartans, to the blues, slowly to the gray, black, white, to the red, to the tan, to the red and yellow and yellow. So yeah, that's how I have this shelf right now. This shelf will definitely be getting some changes. But uh, let's get to the last shelf. This one's not interesting at all, and a lot of it is very unfinished. But I have my any alien type figures down here. So I have my grunts, my elites, any type of elites, and my jackals, and flood, flood spores. Yeah, I just have all these down here because I don't really need them for anything right now. I'm gonna organize it better in a bit. I should have probably did that before I made this video, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, definitely need to do some more organization. Yeah. I'm trying to, I want to knock all them down, okay, but fuck it. Yeah. Honestly, what I'm thinking about doing, I'm thinking about getting some figures getting my uh nerf gun and just shooting them that would be cool do some like target practice type hmm. i never thought about that let me know if you guys want to see a video on that <laughs> <clears throat> uh, i need to put this guy somewhere i still don't know where to put him if anyone knows where i should put this hunter leave a comment because i don't know just gonna put him there for right now back in the same spot but yeah that's gonna conclude this video uh it was pretty pretty weird picking up a camera again but uh felt good hope you all enjoyed this this part one and two of me showcasing my shelves uh, thank you all for watching leave a like if you enjoyed and Just comment what you liked most about how I have my shelves. Honestly, I want to hear some I want to hear some feedback on this for sure and Definitely feedback on this diorama right here and this one specifically because this came straight out of my mind so Leave a like subscribe and I will see you all in the next video whenever that will be who knows if there will even be one no i'm just kidding whenever that will be all right i'll see you guys later